Hello and welcome to the Celebrity Hub. If it's your first visit here, please like and subscribe to receive more information. We are dedicated to bringing you verified facts, updates, and gossip about all your favorite celebrities. Hello guys, it's Valentine's Day, a special day for lovers, but it was even more special to see actor Bruce Willis, who is suffering from frontal dementia, spend the day with his family. Keep an eye on the blog for the complete story. This Valentine's Day and every day, Emma Hemming Willis has her sweetheart Bruce Willis in mind. The wife of the die-hard actor is always content to share the couple's love with the world on social media, as she did this Valentine's Day with an adorable snapshot of the two. The two began dating in 2007 at a gym together and married in 2009, they have since welcomed daughters Mabel Ray and Evelyn Penn Bruce is also a dad to daughters Rumor, Scout, and Tallulah, whom he shares with Demi Moore, his wife from 1987 to 2000. Emma took to Instagram on Wednesday to post a throwback photo of a trip with her husband to what seems to be Niagara Falls. With the Rainbow International Bridge, which connects New York and Ontario, Canada, behind them, the two pose in cozy winter gear, and Bruce smiles against his wife's cheek. In her caption, the Make Time Wellness co-founder wrote, Love is a beautiful thing, adding, wishing you all a happy Valentine's Day. Fans as well as Emma's stepdaughters were quick to hit the comments section under the post and gush over the touching photo, Scout saying, this is amazing, as her younger sister Tallulah agreed. I love this. Others followed suit with, you can see the pure love and joy in this picture, and, so sweet. I'm sending love to you both. I'm sending love to you both. As well as, what a beautiful moment, a fan said, and another fan said, I hope you have a day filled with love. Emma has been a steadfast advocate for her husband's well-being, as well as those with FDD, since the Willis family revealed Bruce's battle with frontotemporal dementia last year. In a piece for Maria Shriver's newsletter The Sunday Paper back in November, she shared her story and her continuing service to the FDD community, stating, As difficult as it was to come forward about Bruce's FDD diagnosis, I knew I needed to raise my voice to raise awareness of this disease, she wrote, the world needs to know that not all dementia is Alzheimer's and that not all dementia affects memory. I wouldn't wish an FDD diagnosis on anyone, but our journey has changed how I perceive the world, Emma noted, and continued, I've become more compassionate. I find that I'm able to hold more space for what others might be going through. I'm holding gratitude as well as grief there's power in becoming an advocate for this community. She added, it's something that I want our kids to see me face out loud, working with others, fighting through the stigma and isolation that a disease like this can bring.